This is really cool, though. Wet lamp on. <laughs> yeah. It's a little, little crackly, but all right. Yeah, that's okay. It's all right. Oh, wow, you see, when you're not there, it shows up. There's like two different things. Yeah. Oh. All right, so worry about the stupid videos. Check, check. Very, very. What the hell was that? Did you hear that? No. Oh, no. <laughs> I. We need more of a night game at Lambo. Um. Yeah, we'll see about that. Yeah. Check, check. Check. Nothing wrong with this. Check, 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 check. So why is this not? Why can I not hear this? Check. Oh, there you go. Check, Thanks. check, 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 check here. Can you hear anything? Yeah, I just heard it when you. There. Oh, there you, oh, there you go. go. Oh, wow, there you are. Yeah, check, 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 check. Okay. Did you start messing with stuff, and then all of a sudden, okay. check. Okay, there you go. <laughs> check, 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 check. Check, check. <clears throat> check, check. Check, 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 check. Okay, can I get, <clears throat> can I get a couple checks from you, Gene? Check, check. Okay, okay. A couple more. Here we go. Right. Um, wow. These would be very good seats if we're at Lambo. <laughs> I'm anticipating we'd pay. Especially if we're doing. Well over 200 for them. Yeah. Check, check. All right. I think. Uh, I think we might almost be ready. Here. Okay. All right. Let me get my drink really quick. Okay. And then what about less sunlight? Oh, do you want to? Uh, well, we can. What happened to the stuff? What? <laughs> you think it's a little bit too bright here? I think or so. What? All right, what do you? I think it's pretty bright. Like that? Yeah. It's a little bit. It's a little bit more faded over there, you know. Mm. It's a little bit more saturation. Oh, good. All right, let's see how it looks. Yeah, let's try it. Two seconds. Yeah, yeah. Forgot all about that. Oh, my gosh. All right, it's a little bit better. Oh, you want to type in the message real quick? Oh, that's okay. Um, what do we got? So should it show up on my... Not yet. Okay. Right, I'm gonna turn the temperature. Okay. Turn the temperature way up. I don't know why it's so uh, desaturated on the Facebook. Oh. Alright, is that a little bit better? Alright. Yeah. So not <laughs> 
Now we look orange, though. That's the that's the yeah. problem. Now we look like Donald Trump. All right, should we? Yeah. <clears throat> Ready. On oh, the, right, okay. Or is it supposed to show right. up right away? Are you? Yeah, it should be showing. Yeah, it's going. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay. This is uh, right. this is uh, quite uh, an extravaganza, an and uh, we're a little flat footed. But Gene, uh, this is the magic. Oh, uh, magic live of, uh, live podcast. That's why I'm wearing my glasses. Yeah, because it's you know, I got uh, very technical. When did you did you? I got my glass. I remember getting glasses. I was in second grade, and that's when I got my first pair of glasses. Uh, I was probably yeah. in, I want to say probably fifth, no, nah, probably third grade. Yeah. You know how the, uh, the teachers would have the, uh, you know, the, the clear plastic on the yeah. projectors, those giant projection oh, machines. There right. were these giant right. machines that all they did was just, uh, project the light. Yeah. Onto the wall. And, uh, yeah, I was squinting a lot, Gene. Well, I'll tell you, if you ever break your glasses, which I did many times, not a good day to come home to your father. Especially after you've been drinking, yeah. which was every day. Do you know year. how many? Do you, do you know how many hours of work? Oh well, I those goddamn remember. glasses cost yeah, him to to I, bring. He seemed he seemed to have bring home. He always seemed to have money for uh, his buddies at well, the bar. Well, so I don't know. Yeah, I know, right? It, it they, came, they when it came to hey, us. It, yeah, um, they ain't, they ain't gonna buy you glasses. Me. Yeah, we're right? costing us. Yep. Yeah. Uh, you know those glasses are just another round. Yeah, he could have oh uh, spread the wealth. Yeah. All right, well, Gene, you know it's yeah. a, it's a very uh, let's not oh, let, let's Hollywood. not let's not think about the dark days. No, let's think about the day after the Oscars. Uh, uh, which correct, and I let's, think it's the first time I a movie's won that I haven't seen. Well, Gene, let's uh, introduce the show first. This is why the, don't you do that? This is the Midwest Sports Show. Okay, good job. And uh, my name is Chris Atz, and oh. uh, that's Gene Steichen. Oh. And we do a uh, broadcast on mm. Gene's Facebook page, and also uh, we put it up on uh, YouTube. Oh, and we got some fancy graphics uh, are, this week. You, I, it's amazing what you. And done. we're actually remote. Yeah, recording right remotely from uh, the frozen tundra Lambeau Field. I didn't know there's an actual gre- a G in the end zone. Is that always there, or did you? What do you mean the G? Too? What are you talking about? In the end zone. See, there's what a G on the screen. Oh yeah. <laughs> Is that G? No, G, G. It's a watermark. I mean, what do you think? Oh, or, I see. Yeah, uh, the, the stance. I'm. I uh, no, wait. yeah, Gene. I'm gonna go to Green Bay. I might go to the opening day. Anyway, the Oscars were last night, well, and G- Gene, you're totally ignoring the fact that we're in Lambeau Field. Oh, we're in Lambeau Field. See now, this. Oh, it's great. See now, this is Lambeau. <laughs> this is the first Lambeau oh, leap yeah. over there, right? It's hard to get permission. And then, it, and then yeah, these are right. my these are my uncle's seats, uh, mm-hmm. where he would get blotto. Right. Uh, every Sunday and go deer. And then uh, we a little bit over. <laughs> I see. Right, Gene, we... It's hard to get permission to do a remote from Lambo. <laughs> well, we pulled it off, Gene. And yeah. somehow at 5, I don't know uh, five how you did it. At 5 p.m. Right. Uh, on the West Coast time. It's still very bright out here. Well, you know, yeah. Gene, the, the days yeah. are getting longer. Hey, it's still at March. Doesn't March. Do you, oh, anyway, I didn't watch the Oscars last night. I went to Kinky Boots, which is a musical. So there you go, <laughs> well, <laughs> at yeah. the Pantages Theater, which is on Hollywood Boulevard. Don't you think? Don't you think when you get to March, you you feel as if winter is almost over? But then I looked at the uh, forecast for Chicago. N- it, winter's not almost over. They 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 got some tough times ahead. Uh, they're screwed. Yeah. Uh, do you you think may say. Don't you think March you start to feel like oh it's almost over? Uh well I know in Wisconsin it was more like April and then, yeah uh, I know would, but uh, March at least uh, March is in February yeah. although it's not even March it's February what well Gene did you well Gene you know uh, us oh. being even though we're in Lambo right oh, now yeah, Lambo. you know uh, being that. in Los Angeles right we uh we we've had some cold days as well yes I believe you know? has 
uh, Los Angeles. Oh, L.A. Has this been the coldest winter you can remember? Well, Gene, uh, I would say yes uh, Me too. to that. And uh, I, although I think one of the first winters I was here, like in 06, was uh, pretty okay. cold, too. Yeah. Uh, but mm. uh, and actually, Gene, there's proof uh, the L.A. Times reported that this is the coldest February, I don't know, in like 100 years or something oh, really? like that. Oh, yeah. really? Okay, so it's not just me. All right, because no. I, I, I thought that, but uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, all mm-hmm. right, well, there you go. There's some local uh, L.A. news. So, Gene, uh, yeah, it was the Oscars. Gene, I am proud to say Oh. I did not watch one goddamn second <laughs> I went back, of the Oscars. I, I did record it, and I'm glad I did, and I went back, and I watched Queen's, Queen open the show. And then after that, I didn't watch. <laughs> was it, it was it the real Queen? It was the real yeah, band, except Adam for Freddie Lambert, Mercury. Brian May and the the drummer. Oh, it's so how about great. the guy? Why not the guy who played uh, Freddie Mercury? Rami, because I don't think he can sing. That no. I I don't know if they want to. The night he won the Oscar for Best Actor, he uh, if he could have if he could have sang, I uh, maybe I would have given him the Oscar. In, in, instead, no thanks. And uh, yeah, and yeah. Glenn Close. Uh, anyway, I didn't watch it, but. Uh. Well, I saw it. I was there every day at the Oscars. Well, so. Gina, I actually had some business in uh, Hollywood. Oh, you did? So you so, saw the whole setup? Uh, yeah. And Gina, I, uh, I thought it was a little bit more open so the fans could actually like see you stuff. You can up till Saturday. Well, Sunday, yeah, you maybe, can't get anywhere close. Yeah, it was on Saturday. Oh, you were? Oh, they, yeah. they, well, they have, uh, they and, like, have, they, they have it all, yeah, they have it all closed up. Yeah. The, oh, that's like that all the time. Okay. Maybe okay. I misspoke. Right. Yeah. Right. So it's all, I mean, you can't really see anything. And, like, uh, yeah, I mean, I thought the whole point was that the fans could, like, uh, right. say, hey, hey, over here and take pictures with the phones yeah. and all that stuff. Uh, but it's pretty much just like, hey, uh, all you, uh, street urchin, <laughs> all you, uh, non winners, get out. Right. Right. Get out. Yeah. Stay yeah. away. And then Sunday they have uh, Hollywood Clubs all the way to Vine. Oh, but Gina, and Gina, I was walking down, uh, you know, the street towards Hollywood High again. Yeah, this Hollywood is a very High for, for, for Midwest Sheiks. Midwest sports show. This is a very uh, L.A. Uh, right. But Hollywood who, who based uh, show. Their, their school nickname are the Sheiks. Well, I think it was a simpler time back in the '30s when okay. they did all this stuff. I think uh, Mecca, because you know, there's a city called Mecca. I right, see. Mecca, California. Right. I think uh, Saudi oh, Arabia. Right. Yeah, you. I right. think the Air, uh, right. Arabian Peninsula was a all the rage back right, in the right. 20s or the 30s or something. Mm-hmm. Um, so, anyways, yeah, you know, I'm walking down the street towards Hollywood High, and I'm trying to take a right. Uh, I don't even know what that's called, oh, but that little street. Yes. Yeah. You know? Yeah. We have two uh, little streets. One, you're right behind Jimmy Kimmel Theater. Yeah, exactly that street, and uh, no sirree. No. They you asked for my credentials. <laughs> You couldn't even go down those streets. Yeah. I, I mean, well, that Jimmy Kimmel's lot, his, it, there was all yeah. uh, trailers and all that right, stuff. So right. whoever all owns the Oscar that. People were back and there. Whoever owns that, I mean, I, I wonder yeah. how much they increase the prices every single year. I don't know. Well, what else are they going to do? Yeah. I mean, yeah. you know, where else are those people going to go? That they, uh, the, yeah, you couldn't even go down those side streets. But it was tough for me. Gene, uh, yes. you know, I, I pay taxes. Okay, yeah, I mean, and we pay a lot in it's California. It's a public street. I don't give a fuck about your Oscars. Oh, I, I want to cross the street. I want to yeah. go down the street. Mm, that's good. I think where I live, Hollywood and Highland, I think that is the busiest intersection, or that area has got to be in L.A., don't you think? Or do you You don't know enough about it, but I, I, no, I'm uh, going yeah. I mean, th- I'm sure there's some place like in uh, no. Beverly Hills no. or something like that. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, all right. Hollywood and Highland. I Believe me. No. Nope. All right. And oh, Gene's Jean, Jean seen it all. What did you see? Gene, you're, you're you telling see me like it? Venice and like no. uh, Normandy or whatever I, like no, that? Like I, not? I, 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 no. Are no, you trying to get in the 405 or something? No. No. Right. All right. Well, so, Gene, you you were walking around and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, I was did there you, every day last week. Did you, see, did you get frisk? Did anyone frisk you? Uh, no, but the, I, I couldn't go. I was like you. It was nice because I walked to the gym one day and you can't go down to Hollywood, but they take you inside the, the ball. But like the secret, you go down these tunnels. It was pretty cool. Yeah, it felt kind of like a celebrity. Yep. Yeah. Pretty nice. V- VIP? Yeah, I like the whole setup. Uh, the actual show, eh, no thanks. Not I so don't much. care. Again, I did not watch one second. Did you yeah. watch any? Did you watch it? I watched Queen. I watched the opening. <gasps> well, I watched it later. I don't think I, I mean, I didn't see a single goddamn movie. I and mean, then, maybe there was a then, documentary oh, nominated, Michael, but. Michael Meyer and Dana Carvey did a Wayne's, Wayne's World. World? Yeah, right. to do well, not really. They just showed a clip from Wayne's World when they introduced Bohemian Rhapsody. I yeah, they that. should do a sequel to Wayne's yeah. World when they're like old and, and then, decrepit. And then Lady Gaga, Br- Bradley Cooper, 
got on stage yeah. and sang. I watched a little bit of that. This is an Alex Sulkin joke, but uh, oh. I, I heard Bradley Cooper pretty much uh, made love to uh, Lady yeah, Gaga that, the whole night. Right, like, what right. if you're uh, Br- Bradley Cooper's uh, girlfriend? Yeah, I don't know. Feel pretty bad, right? Yeah, I heard that a lot too. Yep. And they won right. the Oscar. He didn't. She did. She wrote for the best song. actress. Oh no, no for song. Uh, song. Yep. All right. Yeah. And then I don't know what this uh, the movie that's basically driving Miss Daisy in reverse one. Right. And then and Spike I, Lee I, I, what, tries to leave. And what's what's uh, what, 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 uh, on protest? Yes. Because like was it wasn't the movie like lies or something like that or like a, I don't know. a white white fictionalized uh, version of it sanitized he didn't, version? Maybe didn't like the director Dumb and Dumber winning a, a, a Oscar. Yeah. He's like, what do I what do I got to do? Well, yeah. hey, hey, uh, Spike. Although he did win an Oscar last night. Yeah. What did he? Was it like a lifetime Oscar? Or what was no, it for? he won. He won four guys won for adapted screenplay. Oh God, he's <laughs> he co-wrote it with three other guys. It was yeah. a. It was a. He he didn't. I mean, it's was not it a documentary or was no, it? No, it's based on a book, I think. Yeah. I uh, I mean listen. Uh, the, the Academy Awards is just basically uh, here. We're just gonna give Oscars to like minorities now. I mean that's that's what yeah. basically it is now. Well, yeah, if you I mean, I don't watch any of these movies. Maybe I these know. movies are good, but right. it's like, yeah. I was I, hoping Black I, Panther would have won, though. That I have no respect. For I have no respect for the Oscars. Yeah, I haven't right. had respect for the Oscars for 20 years, probably. Hey, you know who I had respect for? And this is Midwestern. Saturday night, I saw Bob Seger in the Silver Bullet Band. He, fantastic. <laughs> so good. He's 73. He's on his farewell tour. And uh, wow, was he good. Wow. Right. Although it's at the forum where the new football stadium is. And I'm telling you, how are people going to get there? How? How are people going to get know. to the stadium? The, the subway, right? Yeah. No. The subway? Are they going to build a subway to the stadium? <laughs> I don't know. It's uh, L.A. traffic is not good. Not good. Who am I to complain? Not there. good at all. All okay. right. Well, Gene, uh, yes. enough. Uh, show enough of this uh, chicanery. Okay. But I, I love the police. They had a huge police presence in Hollywood <laughs> all week, so that was good. Yeah. And then I was on Hollywood Boulevard today, and uh, it was just uh, the rubble of a, a long night. The devastation. Yeah, right. right. Yeah, I think so. All right, so again, uh, welcome uh, to the Midwest Sports Show. And uh, again, we're uh, broadcasting live from uh, Lambeau Field. Lambeau Field. <laughs> so uh, quite. And uh, we're going to do a little uh, podcast oh, uh, on the field here. Wow. Um, people, well, that people say, wow, Lambo looks, uh, it's very green for March, or the field's already Well, green. Gene, I, uh, there's the little secret. Oh, it's uh, February. It's turf. What am it's, I saying? It's oh, turf. it is. It's fake. Turf. It's fake. Yeah. Sorry. Okay. Sorry, guys. All right. They, re- they, they replaced it in telling them. All right, but Gene, we're going to start with football. Yes. Even though football ended hey, um, a month uh, ago. I, I believe that AAF, days ago. that new league, I bet they're on life support already. Gene, I'm how much? Uh, what do you think I've watched more of the Oscars or the uh, AAF? Take I, a guess. I watch. I watch Queen's opening number. They did "We Are the Champions" and uh, uh, "We Will Rock You," and that <laughs> that four minutes what? was more. You than have I've to watched. do Bohemian Rhapsody. No, right? I know they didn't, All but right. that that four minutes is more than I've watched of the new football league, and okay. I'm a football fan. But yeah. yes, right. so I'm saying I don't. Uh, you can. You well, Gene, what? football never sleeps. Oh, I see. So, have you watched it? Did Football you watch news. Those? Well, I'm not. I'm not watching that game. The San Diego. What is that? They're the this skill. Uh, the San Diego Marine, drunken Marine. <laughs> yeah, there's something like that. There are uh, hulls. I don't know. There's something. <laughs> right. about, there's something on a boat. San Diego. Something. Portholes. Yeah. Pegs. Yeah. The peggers. Yeah. The yeah. pegs. Yeah. All right. Well, Gene, we're gonna talk. Uh, yes, about. Robert Kraft, and oh uh, you may ask yourself, what does this have to do with the Midwest sports show? Yeah, what show? does it? The Midwest. I mean, he got busted well, in Florida. Well, Gene, the Florida, yeah, you're right, Florida, New oh, England. Oh, I know. All right, go ahead. They played in Kansas City the night he got busted. <laughs> well, that's part of it. And, and why uh, was he in Florida in the also, morning? Also, t- well, Gene, we'll get to that. Don't, oh, don't, don't. <laughs> All right. Uh-huh. Gene uh, loves uh, <laughs> shooting his wad, like oh, uh, said Robert hey, Kraft early I, on. I must admit, I've never gotten a massage in my life, so have no you, happy Have ending. you ever gotten a setup <laughs> no. correct in your life? All right. <laughs> no. All right, no. so uh, okay. what was that to do? Well, first of all, Gene. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you're right. They did play the Chiefs later that day, but also Tom Brady from Michigan. Oh, yeah, that's your fallback. <laughs> yeah, there you right, go. Right. There you go. And uh, also, the uh, I think everyone hates the Patriots, so it's right. kind of a feel-good. It, it literally is a feel-good 
yeah. uh, story except for the uh, trafficked uh, sex workers. But we will uh, talk about that as well. Right. Yeah, and, they are. Uh, they are. I didn't know much about sex trafficking, but th- it sounds like those women in that place were being sex trafficked. That's not good. It sure does. I didn't know we did. I was hoping we didn't do that, but I guess, you know. Yeah. Well, uh, Gene, first of all. Yes. Uh, Robert Kraft was charged with uh, prostitution and solicitation. Right. And that, uh, the facts, Gene. First of all, the facts. Okay. And uh, what, Jupiter, Florida? Somewhere. I remember Jupiter, Florida was always, they always mentioned that on like the Today right. Show. Yeah. You know, or Wilford Brimley or whatever. Right. I was like, who gives a fuck about Jupiter, Florida? Like, what? Like, hmm. how about you give me some Miami? Miami, some right. Some Miami right. news or right. something like that. Yeah. Um, and apparently, so it was basically a, a massage parlor and, uh, Looking like a CDS uh, oh spot. Gosh, it looks the like sign it, was all yeah. It looks like one of these spots you see here in LA, like these little mini mall spots. But do they do uh, that? Here? Where there's like a Thai place, there's like a dry cleaning, right, and, right, uh, right. There's like a liquor store. There, there's one right by my where I live uh, in Hollywood, and I mean, I got my friend a massage there, but she didn't get a happy ending. Well, Gene, well, Jean, well, I don't. well Jean, there are. L- 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 let's I've just, never. There I've are never legitimate. Done. No, I think places. the one by my house. I've never even gotten a massage in my life. Have you ever had one? Oh yeah, for sure. Really? <laughs> yeah, Gene. The... But also, not not all that stuff. But oh, uh, yeah. The... But I've never G- even had a massage. Well, G- well, okay. So a massage is great in theory, and it feels really good when it's happening to you. But here's my thoughts. Hmm. Like ten minutes later, when you're walking away, you just you just it, it goes away. It's done. Oh, then it's over. No good. Yeah, so it's like uh, kind of a waste of sixty yeah. bucks. But if I knew if I knew uh, the women, they're being exploited. How can you? You can't stand for that. Those guys deserve to all be getting well, publicly Gene, shamed. Uh, he, uh, what do you call it? Uh, was charged. Apparently, there's video evidence. Yeah. Hmm. Boy, Gene, to, to be the detective to watch right, that right. video. Oh. <laughs> How could was, was that guy uh, charged with wow. masturbating <laughs> in a public space? Because uh, I don't know how good. I could help myself. I don't know. That couldn't have been good. <laughs> oh, they have to All right, there you go. That's that. the first joke. That was a good one. Joke number one. I did okay, not write that one down. Okay. All right, so uh, a couple more details, Gene. All right, yeah. well, first of all, Robert Kraft, yeah. He, but busted. He probably, he, nothing will probably happen, but at least he's been public. Well, Gene, l- let me ask you some. Let me ask you this. Yes. Well, w- w- was his balls deflated? Oh. Right. Rim shot. <laughs> let me get a rim shot on this. You're not supposed to say rim shot with the massage <laughs> oh, parlor. Did he get a rim <laughs> shot? By the way, yeah, that's right. After he finished, what's it called? Oh, forget it. I don't want to say. <laughs> I don't. Even, okay. All right, and then, I thought uh, about that when they described why well, he's all naked and this stuff. I was like, "Oh wow, I forgot they had to watch that." Oh boy. Um, and apparently he went uh, twice within a 24-hour yeah, span what the before, hell? and he's, he he's again he went. Seven, he's he, in his upper seven. He went well, and then Gene, he didn't he just like knock up like a hot like 30-year-old yeah, yeah, or something like that. Like you, you tell me that, yeah, exactly. You uh, tell me you this guy can't. Get like fine I, trim, I like know. outside a goddamn sleazy yeah, and uh, and rugby also, tug. Yeah, and he's got a game that night in Kansas well, City. Gee, if you had to play against Patrick Mahomes, you'd be really nervous too, right? Yeah, you, I guess you, so. You'd want to relax, mm. you know? Yeah. Also, was he like half drunk at the time? I, I mean, he he seemed like he he partied. Can way you too can hard. you can you imagine? And then, by the way, this is Bill Simmons' defense. Uh, ever oh, since oh, his, he did, he blamed I heard he yet. blamed it on his wife's death. Uh, his, his wife died he's, 15 years he ago. He said ever since his wife. You know, that's a good point. You're right about that. Yeah, a slow decline the she past 15 years. years ago. Yeah. I'm not and, sure. And uh, he immediately it. found himself like a 20-year-old girlfriend, right? That's bad. Uh, so, but yeah, but he was, ba- yeah, by the way, Bill Simmons was basically saying on his podcast that uh, it's just a mental decline. And uh, he should probably step down from uh, running the that's, Patriots. I, You know what? Um, it, it makes me even more, uh, uh, my, it makes me more. Determined never to to go through life without ever going into a massage parlor for myself. Well, uh, it's probably I, hopefully, or or soliciting a, w- a working woman, which I've never done either. It's probably ho- hopefully sound even advice. if it's legal. The Bunny Ranch, never been there. Yep, don't need to. No. Yeah, sound advice. Um, and Gene, what uh, what's always so ironic mm. about stuff like this is that it comes comes out that he uh, donated a hundred thousand dollars. Yes, I know. To an anti-sex trafficking organization. Mm-hmm. 
Did you know we had sex trafficking Gene, in Florida? Gene, a hundred thousand dollars. Uh oh. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. Gene, well, I, 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 he, he, he probably he probably thought that meant he got a lifetime of free hand jobs for the rest of his life. Right, I mean, right. that's probably. Yeah. Sorry, I, that's I you were on to something. Yeah, there. you stepped on it, but it's right. all right. Uh, but yeah, Gene. Uh, again, shaming. Gene. Let's uh, again, wait, this is a comedy show. And yeah. we're, we're making and jokes, I, I but think, uh, I don't think anything's gonna happen. The NFL might. Well, he'll fine he'll him. pay the fine. They'll yeah. they'll probably suspend him for a year. Oh, and uh, I don't think so. Oh, for sure. I, I, it's just the owner. Who cares? The guy doesn't run the organization. No, I know. Um, yeah. Actually, they'll, they'll probably force him. To I'm sit. just disturbed. I didn't know that stuff when I know there's massage parlors like that, but I didn't know they're doing sex trafficking because those that means the women are there against their will. Well, hey, who knows? Maybe he's, maybe one of these young girls uh, enjoys jerking off a seventy-five-year-old. Uh, uh, that's gotta be. And you know, what I love is the idea of Robert Kraft being driven to this spot. Oh, I mean, what kind of car? Uh, what do you think this guy was? I don't know. Like a Benz? He like gave a, him each a like, like a Bentley? Yeah, he had two. Yeah, ones. what is this guy tipping? I know because he, he only gave him. He's about to win the AFC Championship. He did tips a hundred bucks. Well, I think that includes. Uh, I don't know if that includes massage. To, damn, I don't know. Oh. And uh, Bob, me. Bob Kraft, you, you can't jerk off on the plane yourself. I mean, okay. You, you need, <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> God. I know. It seems like your priorities are somewhat uh, screwed up. I I'd be just all in on the game. Okay. Can't right. you just buy a? Can't you just get a girl to do that and just give her a purse? Right, yeah. Give her a Louis Vuitton. I mean, that's how it works. Yeah. Uh, he he obviously doesn't care anymore. He yeah. just doesn't. I'm not gonna yeah. bust my ass anymore. Right. He's got to make a statement at some point. I'm gonna get He'd right to like, the point. Oh well. All know. right, so there you go. The G, that was the that was the news. Right, right. About uh, Bob, and then uh, we just have a little uh, quick hits because we are in the inner uh, sports season where I, I actually care about. I thought the inner bowels of sports. Hey, March Madness is right around the corner though. Pretty good. That'll be awesome. Yep. Iowa and Wisconsin and Iowa State are all going to be in the tournament, so that's going to be exciting because Iowa hasn't been in a long time. Wisconsin's always there, but yeah. All right. Any predictions? Iowa, Sweet 16. That's oh. my prediction. Oh. Iowa in the Sweet 16. Yes, for sure. Well, not for sure. They got to get there first. You guys must have gotten some black kids yeah, playing for we, your team. Yeah, we do. I don't Oop. know where they got. <laughs> not from Iowa, that's for sure. <laughs> But yeah, we not do. not not from Quad We're, City. I, I right? think four of the starters still are white, but we do have a. Oh, I'm not sure. We have one or two really right. good. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, Kirk Cousins, yes. uh, the quarterback for the uh, Minnesota Vikings, guaranteed eighty million dollars. Mm. Um, d- did not make the playoffs uh, last year, as far as uh, my research says. Uh, tweeted out uh, that in 2010, I was mad at King James, uh, LeBron James. For leaving Cleveland. Wow. But I've been in uh, Miami for a total of five minutes, and now I totally understand. Oh. He tweeted this. Wow. Uh, K- Kirk. You, yeah, you, this is directly you, you right. Never, this is right to Kirk. You've played yeah. the Dolphins before, right? I mean. Yeah. you played the Dolphins, right? Yeah. You've been in Miami before. You, you don't know what the weather is like in Miami? Mm. Good Lord. Yeah. Who's Kirk to criticize any city? He ought to just wear it by well, himself. <laughs> By the way, uh, Kurt, you've been a professional quarterback for like six years now. You've never been to Miami and like partied Miami. Yeah. Well, what do you do? Re- reading Bible passages? Mm. Rim job. <laughs> Getting rim jobs? Mm-hmm. All right. You, okay. No, I don't want to. All right. And then uh, we got news out of uh, oh, J- Jacksonville. Yeah. Dom. Uh, that Dom Capers How? was hired by the Jaguars. He's not defensive coordinator. As a, well, he's a quote unquote consultant. Oh, consultant. And uh, I dug a little deeper into this, Gene. Yeah. Apparently, he's going to be the uh, toupee consultant for Tom <laughs> Coughlin. He's going to yeah. give him good advice there on uh, what 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 rug to buy. Wow. He never did confirm, or it, they never. It's just weird, right? With his hair. <laughs> I don't know. But Gene, I, he, I've seen enough evidence. He's he's how how he he did have a good reputation until he got to Green Bay. Uh, don't you? Right? Yeah, I mean, look, we got Mike Pennon. He's bald. I mean, don't you want your defensive no, coordinator to I be know, bald? But I mean, I'm just talking about him as a coach. I don't uh, get. Uh, I well, don't know if I guess, want him as a consultant. I, I guess the, he helped win the Super Bowl, right? So no, they didn't win. Well, <laughs> I mean, 2010. Oh, they won. that one. The oh, okay, you're right. Uh, yeah. I take it back. Sorry, Dom. All right. Oh, speaking of Dom, I am rewatching The Sopranos. It's fantastic. The next go around, just as it was the first one, 
so good. Yeah. Awesome. Have you watched it? No, thank you for that, Gene. No, okay. I have not watched it. I, I just, well, Dom, I, I, I think I haven't, they haven't introduced one, but it seems like there would be a Dom character. Maybe there. <laughs> yeah. Gene, we're in Lambeau Field. <laughs> oh, is it beautiful? It's really amazing. Yeah. Oh, so you're peaceful. A, it looks like you're wearing a short sleeve shirt. You feel the, uh, you feel the history being right. here. You know oh. what I mean? Uh, Bart Starr. Yeah. <laughs> Fred you know Favre. Where they, you know where they used to play? Uh, City Field. Over, over there. Oh, over there. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, Ashwaubenon. Oh yeah. All right, Ashwaubenon's it, over it, there. It's uh, <laughs> it, I went. It's called City Field, and uh, it's over there, and yeah. Yep. There you Before go. Lambo. Now these are visual gags, uh, people. Oh, happy hundredth right, uh, anniversary to the NFL upcoming. Yep. Although and the Packers uh, celebrated last year. And yeah. then, Gene, uh, our final football story, uh, Megatron, Calvin Johnson, doing? yeah, MMJ, um, is investing in pot dispensaries. Oh, okay. Yeah. Pot dispensaries, Gene. Hmm. Megatron, marijuana. And, what uh, is this? Well, MMJ? Gene, you know their, th- their, their, their hook, their tagline? Yeah. It's going to be the best pot that you ever saw. Right. But, <clears throat> but it's going to go away early because it has a shitty quarterback. So. Oh, that's 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 the wrap on the wow. on, on the marijuana. Again, yeah. let me repeat that. So it's it's gonna be the best marijuana you ever saw. Yeah, but it's not gonna last long because you got a shitty quarterback. Yeah, um, like the Detroit Lions. That's right. the uh, all right. That's I the, don't know if they'll the, ever get it right. Hey, you know when I was in college, everyone smoked marijuana. I never did, but it used to be. I used to think, wow, these people are drug addicts, and now it's like, oh, whatever. Who cares? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then you met me, and then uh, yeah. you're like, all right. Well, you're taking it to a whole new level. <laughs> but, yeah. You're like, well, I thought those guys were truck addicts. Right, huh? right, <laughs> yeah. All right, and then, Gene, uh, it's uh, spring training, Gene. Yes, you, I uh, watched it today. Guess who I watched today? What the Brewers at is the it Angels. On, uh, is it on the MLB TV? No, or what is yes, it? MLB's carrying spring training. This one was on the Angels because well, they're playing the Angels. I know the Brewers actually played the Cubs, I think, like first game. Yes. Or something yeah, like that. Chris Cubs Bryant hit like a two-run home run. But I guess, the uh, like. Brewers wore their throwback uh, yellow and blue MB, you know, their yeah, old uh, Ball and hand. Yeah, really cool. Yeah. Nice. So doing a little scouting. I only saw a couple batters and I fell asleep. But, uh, yeah, I, I love it. It's been cold in spring, but I'm going uh, yeah, in a few weeks. So. All right, very exciting. So maybe yeah. we'll, uh, we'll have a broadcast. And I'm going of... to Milwaukee. <laughs> All right, well, it's a small it's a small hop away from Lambeau Field, right? So Yeah, cool. oh, yeah, we're already here, but yeah. the, the Brewers. Appleton. We have to check out uh, Pfizer. If we want culture, we have to go to Milwaukee. Isn't that what uh, that one guy said, Bennett? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. That's very possible. All right, and then Gene, the big news. Uh, everyone was talking about Manny yeah. Machado. Where is he going to go? Is he going to go to the uh, right, Chicago right. White Sox? Well, he, the San Diego Padres. That that is that you want to talk about uh, sailing into obscurity. You know he has no desire to win. He uh, he doesn't right, care. Exactly, uh, exactly. How many World Series rings is he going to win in San Diego? Uh, they'll, they'll, I know everyone's like, oh, they have the best farm system in baseball. Yeah, wait till they get to the uh, major league. I've heard that for ten out. years. Now. I know. Hey, I know they've been to the World Series a couple times, but. Machado, and he had no intention with. I don't think he. I don't think the White Sox. You know, I think what happened. Ball, I don't think they, he was ever. Gonna I think what. With the White I think Sox. what. Well, I think what happened is everyone was slowballing him, give, saying right. five years, and I think San Diego is the only one. He's like, fuck it, I'll, I'll take my money. But that's almost. And he's like, I don't care. When you go to San Diego, oh, maybe that's too mean. But it feels like you're giving up because I don't know. Maybe they'll be good, but. Oh, I don't. I'd be nervous if I was San Diego because you're paying a guy a lot of money. Yeah, oh. well, that's your. Hey, and that's, that's half your payroll, that, isn't it? Bryce this. Harper. Do you know what his problem is? Because he hasn't been signed. He he's he doesn't. He definitely doesn't want to go to Philadelphia. I don't think he will. Well, didn't, didn't Philly just uh, pick up a big free agent too as well? Mm-hmm. Am I wrong about that? Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, I know yeah, Arietta, but he, yeah. Well, the Dodgers mostly offered shorter. All I right. think he keeps hoping the Cubs Mills will get rumor. involved. Yeah, but the Cubs aren't but yeah he he does not seem like he wants to play in philly machado good luck in san diego yeah <laughs> we'll see uh they, never to be heard from again wait well, you're even if you're good you're basically irrelevant though right yeah hmm. yep well yeah who cares what well, yeah, yeah. You, you're gonna help your team win an extra 10 games and uh yeah. still be five games out of the playoff and who ca- yeah. yeah of the wild card mm-hmm. all right so there you go you selfish bastard yeah enjoy the padres buddy I don't know. I yeah, we'll see. Right. And then Gina, we're getting word uh, out of the Pittsburgh training camp. Oh, 
uh, or spring training, whatever. Garth Brooks. Oh, really? Is attending uh, spring training. They let him lace him up again? He did that before. With, oh, with San Diego, he did that. <laughs> Speaking of the Padres. Jeez. One bad decision to another. Right, right. Uh, G- well, gee, my question is, how about Chris Gaines? <laughs> who's, uh, <laughs> who's training camp is he going to? <laughs> Wasn't that the worst? Do you remember that? <laughs> Then he uh, that, that, he was a country guy, and then he like transformed himself to like a rock, like an right, emo right, rock star right, or whatever, right. with black and hair. He, and he wore this really bad toupee. He had an alter ego. Maybe the worst decision in the history of music. Well, I think he just wanted to get away from this country bullshit right, and like right. make a rock album. And, and he was like, this he is- was that went. It couldn't have went really more poorly. And then uh, he ended up going back to what he, you know, what he is now, but. Oh, I didn't know. He he fancies himself a baseball player. Yeah, he does player. that. He does a lot. Gene, your favorite Garth Brooks song? Uh, well, <laughs> I know the one where you drink in low places. That one. Oh, okay. I, not that's my favorite. That's the only one I, I could really tell you. I could you. not name a single. But uh, think let about me it. see. Oh, yeah, you drink. I got friends in low places. That's all I know. But I know he's got a lot. He's very popular. There you go. All right, but that's one more than I can name it. Kenny Chesney, who's also very popular. Uh, yep, there you go. Yeah, it's pretty good. All right, well then, Gene, a uh, little high school, Kenosha, sports which news. is so great. And do you know what this guy called in the Chicago sports radio? Uh, he said there's more Bear fans than Packer fans in Kenosha. Kenosha is near the Illinois mm-hmm. border because these Illinois F- FIBs. Uh, oh, what's FIB? Ca- fucking Illinois bastard. Oh, okay. Uh, these guys come up north and take our jobs. Yeah, that's right. And it's cheaper to live over there, yep, maybe. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Closer to the north woods. Uh, to but the I cabins love and all Kenosha. That. It's beautiful. Home of the Mars Cheese Castle. Yep. Guarded right. by a well, giant mouse. <laughs> all right. Well, Gina, Kenosha has a uh, cheerleading awards. Oh, is that the one with... Oh, I that's oh I didn't know that was and, Kenosha. And uh, there was a bit of a controversy right, right, on right. Uh, some of these awards. And Gene, I don't know about you, as a fellow comedian, Yeah, I'm a little tired of these uh, political correctness. Oh, that that part I'll agree with you on. Let me, that let me, part I'm, I'm, uh, I'm with you let on. Let me read the charges here. Okay. There was the... Now, these were awards that the cheerleader team uh, was handed out on some sort of end whatever award final whatever mm. thing. Uh, there was a big booby award, right, for the girl with the biggest breasts. That seems that seems very <clears throat> irresponsible. The Even coach, I'm, I don't want to be political. For those are high school girls. The right? coach giving the award, according to several parents among the hundred people in attendance, made a joke that the girl r- risked a concussion when she ran because of her enormous, oh, quote unquote, enormous course. boobs. All right, I would have to say there was um, a not, yeah. not only that, Gene. There was a big booty award for another girl. In a video from an event held at a local catering hall. I want this video, by the way. Yeah. Uh, the coach presenting the award said, we love her butt. Everyone loves her butt. Oh. When, Gene, when is this political uh, correctness going to end? Yeah, that one. <laughs> I, no, that one, I, I would have pulled them to sides. Did he make all that? No, they had an actual award. Well, right? it was a woman. Let's just be, we should say this. It was a woman. Oh. The coach is a woman, so oh, this is okay. not a man. These, these yeah, are but women. Still. But still, uh, yeah, yes, not you're, you're correct. Right, right. Uh, the, the cheerleading coach behind the awards, a woman named Patty uh, Utek. Mm. Uh, I, I'm sorry if I doxed her. Um, doxed her? For, are you familiar with the term doxing? No. That's, that's when you give someone's address. Well, I didn't give anyone's address, but you oh. do their address online. Why do they say doc? Because <clears throat> you documented their I don't know. Oh, did you? I how? I've never heard that. Hmm. Gene, I'm. I'm uh, I docked myself then <laughs> earlier when I told <laughs> yeah, people where I was. All right, we understand that we are in a politically correct world these days, but we do like to have fun and keep things on the lighter side. Mm. Wow. Uh, she wrote to the principal. Well, Gene, hey, you know, th- there's a song about this. Girls just want to have fun. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Girls. Oh, Cindy Lauper. Yeah. There you go. Did she get fired or anything, or did I just uh, apologize? Uh, I don't know. I uh, I think uh, basically mm. the awards. I um, I'm telling you though, the political correctness. Gosh, we've gone so apologize. far. That's why I loved. I went to Kinky Boots last night, and and it was about guys and drag, whatever. But did more of that. <laughs> yeah, let's see more of that. Let's well, I mean, that. not that. I well, whatever. All Just right. that you can. I want to do something. All right, so uh, Kenosha. There you go. That's my home state. I didn't Wisconsin. know that was Kenosha. Kenosha is pretty great. Yep. 
Yeah. Oh, and also the Bucks. Speaking of Wisconsin, they have the best record in the uh, the what or Eastern Conference. Yeah, it should be really exciting. I cannot I, wait to talk about them during the playoffs. Don't. <laughs> I'm saving all the I, hot box. I'll stock tell you, for the when I go to Milwaukee, I'm going to go to Pfizer. Is that how Pfizer? Pfizer? Is that the Fister Hotel. Oh, the Fister Hotel, right? Oh, with the ghost? Yeah, no, but where the arena is, isn't it called Pfizer? Is it called Pfizer? <laughs> oh, it's like, yeah, it's like the Fister. Yeah. Like the Fister. Like not, or, uh, Fister tax. is legendary. I would love, I'm going to go. I, hopefully the Bucks are playing, and then I'm going to go. Well, no, because I'm going to the Cubs game that night. Oh, yeah. strike that. But I just want to see the arena. They, Milwaukee's great. Wisconsin's my favorite state outside of Iowa. Illinois, no. Uh, I love Chicago, but I like Wisconsin better than Illinois. And and then third would be Nebraska, maybe. Fourth, I guess, would be Minnesota. Yeah. There we we do this 50 times? <laughs> <laughs> we, got, we got 46 <laughs> more states. Here we do all right, yeah. so we'll, uh, we're going to end it right there. But, Gene, I did see this earlier, but yeah. uh, it is, uh, as you may see this tomorrow, February 26th, it is uh, your birthday. Yes. How, uh, you. What is your uh, – and someone in the comments oh, reminded me. Oh, you know what I'm doing? So what, yeah, what are your plans? You oh, guys? okay, this is very exciting. I'm going to, I'm going to Cinderella tomorrow night. Okay. okay. Be, yeah, it's a musical. And, uh, is it like a, is it like a crazy? Yeah, I think so. Off the wall one or is it a yeah, classic Disney yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, no, it's not. It's not the one. I I've seen that one, the classic one. No, I think I think it's the I think this one's more adult humor. Yeah, right in line right. with Kinky Boots. Well, you're gonna take your uh, private jet and fly no, from Lambo. No, I'm Lambeau? gonna take the subway down to the Amundsen Theater downtown. Okay, yeah. why not? I love the subway. Should be a venture. I wish we had more. But yeah. Nope. Hey, where do you think we'll be next week? Do we already make travel? Well, we have no idea. Whatever is uh, on oh, sale on nice. uh, on the on the tickets. Yeah. I guess maybe we uh, could sit on the rooftop someday and look out over Wrigley Field. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's. Uh, we'll yeah. see. We'll have to talk to uh, the the Ricketts. Yeah. I have to talk to Ricketts. All right. So. So for I got more uh, more surprises here. Oh, you do. Yep. So. F- hey, I want to say uh, my mom. So. Her guy, Lowell, he's he's recovering. He broke four ribs. When you're 84 or 83, that's not good. So, mm, Lowell. All right, well. Everybody. Yeah. Oh, it's my uh, nephew. Yeah. 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 All right. All right. All right. Music playing. Oh, yeah. we don't know. What other surprises do we have? So, uh, uh, for Gene Steiger. For Gene okay. Steichen, the birthday boy. Uh, my name is Chris Satz. I've been got, the Midwest Sports Show. Five, six, five more, six more hours right. before whatever. We'll see you next week. Bye. Mm. Do more surprises. Oh my. <laughs>